uh, high school sweethearts in the big step. In the 50s, let's get married first. In the 70s, let's get stoned first, right? Jerry, your singing is scary, by the way. In the 90s, let's get tested first, and in the, and 2000, let's, let's uh, do national service first. Same age group, same age bracket, completely different attitudes towards life, depending on what how you are shaped at the coming of age stages of life. And also you had, you know, you had iconic figures in entertainment like Barney, I love you, you love me, we're one big happy family, right? You've been there. You know, when I was growing up, my icon was um, a Muppet that lived in a garbage can. His name was Oscar the Grouch. That is an extra experience, think about it. Millennials love everybody. <laughs> they love their parents. They love their friends, and they love the community that they're in. 82% of teens report no problem at all with any family member. That's incredible. I didn't know that IRL, like I didn't know anything about that, like I, until you know several months ago, he's like, IRL, that IRL, like in real life. I'm like, you have to distinguish between real life and what? What is that? But now you do have to do that, right? So that blending is very much a part of this, this digital native culture. 72% of millennials agree that government should work hard to reduce the income gap between the rich and the poor. Be nice, be fair, be equitable. This is the first generation since uh, the GIs, pre-World War II, that really wants a middle class, actually. 70% of millennials agree that with the statement, you know, if a company is unfair, I'll figure out a way to make it fair. Now that sounds a little, it sounds a little like threatening Xer, actually. Um, but, but it's in the name of fairness, you know, and millennials will stand up for fairness. Millennials expect brands to listen to their feedback and engage them in two-way interactive conversation. Don't forget these, participate, create, and share. Participate, create, and share. If you're doing these things in media, you are attracting the millennials and you're getting on the right track.